from the land of peroxide, it's Blondes Have More Fun Week, part two on Hollywood Squares, starring Carol Channing, Barbara Eden, the Coors Twins, Sally Struthers, Doris Roberts, Reba's Melissa Peterman, Victoria Jackson, Jillian Barbary, and this week's center square, Pamela Anderson. And your host, Tom Bergeron. Thank you, John Machina. Welcome to our Tic Tac Hill Fest. I, I don't know about you, but I think we should do Blondes Have More Fun Week every week of the year. Right, guys? Not that I'll have any sway, and, and for all of the women uh, in, in our tic-tac-toe grid, we have the hunky guys as our contestants <laughs> yeah. all week. Thank and we want to welcome in the circle position, Kevin Manns. Welcome, Hello. Kevin. Good Thank to you. have you Thank here. You. And Mr. X is Robbie Chow. Welcome, Robbie. Nice to meet you, We'll be welcome. talking to both of you in just a few minutes. Right now, let's get into our first $1,000 game. Be on the lookout for bluffs. Our stars are encouraged to try to trip you up from time to time. <laughs> Who won the coin toss backstage? All right, Robbie, you begin. Yes, I'll go with Pamela Anderson in the center. Pamela Anderson, her animated series, Stripperella, is on the new Spike TV Thursdays at 11. All right, Pam, to give artificial respiration, tilt the victim's head up and cover their mouth with yours. Meanwhile, what do you have to do with your hand? Depends how well I know them. Yeah. Um, uh, feel for a pulse. I'll agree. Pinch their nostrils. Pinch oh. their nostrils. Circle gets that one. I should know that. What's wrong with me? Kevin? Hello. I would like to go with Julian Barbary. All please. right, Julian Barbary, co host of Good Day Live in syndication. Julian, any actor knows Oscar is holding a sword, but what is he standing on? Well, he's standing in Gucci loafers. I know that. <laughs> um, I think he's on top of uh, the globe of the world. Okay. I disagree. A reel of film is what he's yeah. on top of. Circle yeah. gets that one. Robbie. <laughs> Carol Channing for the block, please. Carol Channing, her one-woman show, An Evening with Carol Channing, opens in January in Palm Springs at the McCullum Theater, then tours nationwide. Carol, what was the U.S. Navy's famous old Ironsides mostly made of? Iron. Iron. I'll disagree. It was made of wood. They named it when oh. cannonballs bounced off the side. Nicely done, X Robbie. gets a block there. <laughs> Kevin. Victoria Jackson, please. Victoria plays Mrs. Woo! Rogers on Romeo Saturday nights on Nickelodeon. Victoria, what are animal rights groups doing to elephants in India to cut down on traffic accidents? Taking away their driver's license. <laughs> 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 um, <laughs> making them stay in the zoo. Okay. I disagree. This is interesting. They're, they're putting <laughs> reflectors on them. Uh, no! Yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Horse triangle? Yeah, so circle gets that square. <laughs> One elephant says to the other one, am I blinking? What is this? <laughs> Robbie? I'll go with Doris Roberts for the block. Doris oh, Roberts right. from Everybody Loves Raymond. How, how many... How many? It's three Emmys now. Three Emmys for Everybody Loves Raymond and one for Saint Elsewhere. Wow. Nice. That's right. Yeah. You, you needed that fourth for Bridge, didn't that's you? Right, yeah, that's right. <laughs> what national group famously says they are the few, the proud? The Natural Blondes. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think it's a group that got the woman's right to vote. All right. I disagree. No, it's the Marines. It's the Marines. X gets the block there. All right, Kevin. Barbara Eden for the win. Barbara Eden. All right, for $1,000, I Dream a Genie airs every day on TV Land. Barbara, I see her tripping where the bright streams play is a line from what well-known old song? Oh, my goodness. Um, Clementine? I agree. I dream of Jeannie with the light brown hair. <laughs> X gets a block there. 
Oops, oh. uh, Robbie. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna go with Melissa Peterman for the win. All right, Melissa yeah. from Reba. Yeah. Friday nights on the WB. According to the Coast Guard rules, if a ship's horn makes three short blasts, what does it mean? Three short blasts? Mm -hmm. I think that means you'd be wise to skip the chowder. <laughs> <laughs> it's a thinker. It's a thinker. Um, okay. Um, <laughs> three short blasts. I believe yeah. that's emergency. All hands on the deck. Okay. I'll agree. No, it means it's backing up. It's just backing up. Circle gets a block there. We get a break. We'll be back with more of this fine broadcast right after this. Stick around. Promotional consideration furnished by the following. Part two. Before we get back to our uh, our slugfest game one, these guys are uh, pretty much playing the whole board here. Let's give them a chance to say hi to you, Robbie Chow, Mr. X. Tell us about yourself. I'm an avid surfer from Kailua, Hawaii. <laughs> I also perform my Hawaiian torch act in a show called Men, where I light certain parts of my body on fire. Oh, wow! <laughs> What, what parts? <laughs> You'll have to come to Vegas to see that. Oh! You're doing your own jokes at home, aren't you? I know you are. <laughs> Kevin Manns, uh, tell us about yourself. I live in Las Vegas where I'm a loan officer. I have my degree in management from the University of Phoenix, and I collect $2 bills. All right. Wow. Good luck. And then you set them on fire. see if you can collect 1000 Your turn. Sally Struthers for the win. Sally Struthers, recurring role as Babette on the Gilmore Girls Tuesdays on the WB. All right, Sally, John Jacob Astor, Benjamin Guggenheim, and Macy's owner Isidore Strauss all spent their last night on Earth in the same place. I know this sounds crazy, but they were the people that always got invited to the White House. They each one, of course, at different times, died in the White House. Died in the White House. I disagree. They were all on the Titanic. Oh! Circle gets the square and the win. $4,000. We're going to play another $1,000 game. This one has a secret square. Let's find out what's in the secret square stash. How do you say relax in Spanish? It's a vacation in Cabo San Lucas. You and a guest will spend six days of unparalleled luxury and privacy at the villas at Hotel Cabo San Lucas, ranked among the top 50 tropical resorts in the world. And you'll fly Aero California, the airline with the most lights and best prices to the Pacific beaches of Mexico. And back to you, Tom. Thank you, John. Let's show all of you at home who the secret square is. Last time we buy sound effects from an unemployed clown. All right. Kevin, you won the first game. You start this one. Let's start with Pamela Anderson, please. Let's. All right. Her new talk show is Club Pam. It airs on satellite radio. Pam, it's new. It's popular. It's called, thank goodness, it fits. What is it? What could it be? Uh, gloves. Okay. Gloves. I disagree. It's a new bra that comes in half sizes. Oh, yeah. Circle that. gets that one. Robbie? I'll go with Victoria Jackson. Victoria. Okay, here we go. Hi, Victoria. Harvard says it has almost 15 million of them, more than any other school in the world. 15 million what? Alumni who think they're better than you. <laughs> okay. I'm, I'm thinking yes. alumni who are lawyers. Okay. I'll agree. No library books. The largest uh, academic <laughs> library in the world. Circle. Gets that one. Kevin, break for you. Barbara Eden for the win. For the win and another $1,000. Right, Barbara, according to USA Today, what's the most used edible pet name couples call each other? Oh, oh my. Oh, my goodness. Oh, well, it's, there's cookie, there's sugar, there's... I'd say honey. Huh. I'm going to agree. That's the most edible pet name Ooh! used. Yeah, honey. Yeah. Circle gets to square 65%. Melissa was 
is our secret square, by the way. We'll be right back with a $2,000 game. Robbie, you can tie it up right after this. Stick around. Promotional consideration furnished by the following.